Hi guys. So today I want to take you to my local nursery, Plant and Sea Nursery. They've gotten a new shipment of orchids and um, there's one that they posted on their Instagram that I've been interested in seeing um, and maybe buying. So I'm going to go check it out and I think they're going to have a lot of different orchids that you're going to want to see. If you want to learn more about orchids, if you're an orchid lover, orchid collector, orchid enthusiast, you're going to want to watch this video. Your eyes are going to enjoy this beautiful orchid eye candy come with me i'll show you it is dedicated to all of you orchid lovers or all of you people that are intrigued with orchids and trying to learn more about them i think you're gonna really enjoy this video i'm at my local plant and sea nursery my local nursery and um, they've just gotten a new shipment so i just need, wanted to do this video so hopefully i can give you names and you can learn a lot more about them and the variety there is because there is so much to learn so i'm going to try to put, if i don't know the names of some if i can find the names i'll put them down here so in the description when i show it so you guys can know i think it's called the lucinda do they have any edible things here yeah. i don't know i don't work here <laughs> outside there's outside there's more fruit trees yeah. outside the fruit trees yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, lettuces and things like that, you know, you can grow your whole Yeah. Yeah, and I mean, they do have it, I'm sure, outside. This is more house plant section. And these... Yeah, a lot of plants I've never heard of. Yes, they have so many beautiful. Look at this beautiful flower. Wow, this flower is just incredible. And this is the name of this orchid. Let's see. Here's the name. Ooh. Uh huh. This one's a little bit different. It has little dots compared to that one. You see that? And the name of this one is right there. Giving you a moment to read the name. Hard to pronounce, so I'm not going to pronounce it. But why I'm intrigued with these is just the flower, just incredible. And then the leaves are just incredible. This is definitely something different of uh, these orchids is the leaf with the spotting the light color versus the normal green that we see so this is beautiful type and here's again the name beautiful 29.99 is the price for these these jewel orchids are just beautiful i own one and it's been easy and mine's not actually flowering itself as well let me try to get a close-up here on the flower let's see if i can get this to focus there it is these are small little flowers but they're just beautiful and dainty look at how mature this one is i mean this is the size of the leaf i've never seen one so nice and big and mature these are 24.99 now back here you see this, the, the bottom of it, how different it is from the other ones? This one has the green leaves, the long stem, which is the more common one that we find. Maybe at Walmart, and most stores have this one. But versus here, back here, this is the type of orchid it is. And these are $19.99. Just the growth pattern is a little different. The flowering is a little different. Look at that beauty. And then up here we have the famous Vanda orchid. This one is just stunning. And you see how the leaves kind of grow up, um, stacked up. And look at the roots. They don't need any soil. You'll just have to like put them in water, let them soak up, maybe in a bucket, and then make sure all that water falls off. And look at the leaves over here. These are. Uh, Trying to find the price for these, but look at this one. Look at the the color. It's just beautiful. Look at that. It is raining. Here's another one of the bandas. <gasps> these leaves, these flowers are huge. Like if I could put my hand there against it, I've never seen orchids with such big flowers. These are so beautiful and healthy. Let me see if I can get. I don't even see the price on this side. Gorgeousness. 
Okay, and then right over here, <gasps> look at this flower. Wow, that's beautiful. These are $39.99. It's a, a, a hybrid. There you go. Oh, look at this flower. Gorgeousness. These are $39.99. So there's definitely a lot here for collectors. There is a name, which jewel ivory lips, ivory lips. <gasps> That flower is just intriguing. Wow. Then we have these here. I've seen these at Lowe's before with a small little yellow dainty flower. It's the name of the orchid. Price $19.99. Look at the way it grows. Very interesting. So nice and yellow. Gorgeousness. Wow. My orchids usually here in North Carolina are flowering for me once a year. I know I've heard of people that can have the orchid flower twice a year, but at least where the size of this flower is quite big. At least where I'm at is just once a year. These are the vanilla orchids, guys, where we actually get the vanilla from. It's a process to get it. And I have this one. $39.99. It's a nice and thick succulent, like. <gasps> Look at this one. Look at that. That's just, <laughs> I'm right now amazed. They don't, I don't see a name for this one. Oh, but look at those, those roots growing out. They seem very dry right now. It probably needs a watering. That color over there. It's a Vonda orchid. If you see these roots that are a little greener, they probably had been watered recently versus some that look very dry i need some watering yeah this one doesn't have a name this one's going out already the flower but yeah these orchids you know again it's not you're not going to have the flower the whole year but fl orchid flowers can last about in my experience about three months three months so i think that's really really good this is more of the common one that we see at walmart Phalaenopsis orchid. Well, not Walmart, but you commonly see these. You see this type of leaves most of the time when you find orchids. But right here, as you're noticing, there's a lot of variety that you normally don't see. Like this one's here. And that's what I think is really cool that you guys can have them see them all here and compare them and see how the foliage is different, how the flowering is different. So there's a lot of different types of orchids so people start collecting these and there's a variety that you can collect okay so that hopefully was i think that's basically a little uh nice little video to show you guys all the different types of orchids there's one that's not here that i'm gonna have to show you that i have in my house uh that's just a stunner too and i think that's gonna give you nice a nice maybe not complete good there's so many types but there's a lot of variety here that hopefully you've been able to enjoy let's see here let's see if you can get that one and the name there you go very nice Hey guys, so this is the other jewel orchid that I have already, Makotas Petola. And um, oh man, this plant, I don't even have to tell you how mesmerizing it is. It's mesmerizing to the eye. Look at that. It just looks like lightning striking in the leaves. Um, this one does give a little flower. Uh, mine's about to flower here in my Ikea greenhouse. 
Um, that one right there, you see it has all the stems up. So it's about to flower. So, and this is my Lucidia Discolor. And that's the flower of the this other jewel orchid that I have already. Let me try to get this to focus on. There we go. So very, very dainty. You see that net playing around? <laughs> Anyhow. So just oh, and I wanted to tell you that these multiply. I purchased one, they had two, and now I have I divide I have this one and that one out of that one plant. And now, if you see, it still can be divided up. So these multiply easily. So you could always sell one in the future, make your money back, or just keep them like I have them right now, share them with a friend. I'm about to do a repot, guys. Subscribe to my channel if you like seeing planty things. Um, I'm about to repot all these plants. <laughs> so yeah, um, I love plants. If you love plants, um, don't forget to give it a like. And there'll be a lot more planty content coming up. Bye and subscribe.